Friends of Christians Engage, it's Christmas, December 25th. It is so great to be with you as we pray today. We're going to pray Matthew 2, 11, and we're going to pray specifically for our leaders in Washington, D.C. But as we're thinking about the Christmas story, let's read this together. And when they had come into the house, they saw the young child with Mary, his mother, and fell down and worshiped him. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented gifts to him, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Can you imagine the leaders, the wise men coming before the child king and giving up their gifts? Really, that's what we want for our leaders in Washington, D.C. and our national leaders to do, is to submit themselves to the Lord, to worship Him, and to see their part in His life. So let's pray. Let's pause right now and let's pray for our leaders in Washington, D.C., that they would humble themselves. Lord, we just pray for our leaders in Washington, D.C. right now, from the White House, from the Supreme Court, to our federal court systems, to Congress. Lord, we pray for our executive branch. We pray for all of the uh, leaders throughout uh, Washington, D.C. that represent us from the State Department um, and through the Treasury Department and all of the places of influence. God, we pray that our leaders today on Christmas Day will cry out to the Lord would humble themselves before the mighty hand of God. And Lord, that they would lay their lives down like these wise men did at the feet of Jesus. They would lay their lives down and their gifts before the Lord and that you would use their lives for your glory. God, we pray for revival in Washington, D.C. this Christmas. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks for joining us every Monday. We love you guys so much. Merry Christmas.